Hello, hello. This is Mystic Mohawk, and I come to you today. <clears throat> Excuse me. I am horse as I don't know what because I went to a baseball game with my daddy on his birthday. Child, my voice is gone. But anyway, yes, and the Nationals won. But anyway, all right. So anyway, Divine Masculine is in the energy where he now feels that the feminine has options. Mm. And he also feels that Divine Feminine's options is better than him. And Divine Feminine in the energy, and she is in the energy where she feeling like, how you gonna get mad at me? Cause I put you on you. Hey, I put you on you. How you gonna get mad at me? Cause I put you on you. Hey, yes, I'm doing to you. What you did to me, says Divine Feminine. When these things get done to you, you don't like it, Divine Masculine, do you? I don't think you do. So let's just end these energies where Divine Feminine's feeling. How you gonna get mad at me? Cause I will love you on you. Yes, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Why is Divine Masculine in this energy where he feel that Divine Feminine is pulling a him on him? Holy Spirit, what is the energies that Divine Feminine feel about this Divine Feminine? What is these energies that he think about when he think about Divine Feminine, Holy Spirit? Okay, so I got to walk up on this one and put my hand on it. Because, honey, baby, darling, dear, he feel like you in the Empress energy. And he feeling like all those around you is appreciating that Empress energy. He feels like, yeah, Divine Feminine is creative. Her personal growth and her self-development is at an all-time high. She is currently successful. She brings joy and grounding and spirituality to those around her. People gravitate to her aura. She's happy now. She's in an energy where she don't know where her, where this, all these things is going on around her. But she loves this energy that she's in. And she's like divine bring it on to this energy. She's in an energy where she's now feeling comforted. She's in an energy where she feels security and protected because she had her ancestors guiding her and she had her the ground lead in her way and she feel her spirituality has got her through a situation of where she do not want to go. So she, what other energies is she in? Mmm. Mmm. Why are you pulling the you on you, Divine Feminine? Oh, Divine Feminine is in a justice energy. She said like she got justice because her mind, her energy of her ancestors was, she gave all that energy back. So she's in a Libra. She's in that lucky Libra energy. She's in a justice energy because she feel like her comics was doing all these things to her and she sent it on back to them. And she knows she got the, the ancestral guidance and the ancestral protection. And she feels like she got her justice. She's now in a fair energy. She's now in a security energy. She's in an energy where she ain't letting nothing or nobody stop her growth from coming. She's in an energy where she ain't letting nobody stop her from getting that bag. She's in an energy where if you is negative, I'm going to slide it over here like that lucky league, but I'm going to move in silence, but I'm going to keep that balance and I'm going to keep on going like that lucky league. And she's in an energy where she can take on the world. She's in an energy where I am woman, hear me roar. Yeah. She is in that energy, okay? Where don't mess with me. I'm in an energy where I'm doing me. I know that's right, girl. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What is the other energies 
that this one, this divide our collective is in where she said I'm doing a you on you. Okay. Mm-hmm. So this one is in a chop me on up energy. She's in a ten of pentacles energy. She ain't playing. She ain't playing. She's in a ten of pentacles energy. She's in a energy where she's in see receiving her ancestral and her two gifts. She's in an energy where she's maintaining her, her material success. She's in an energy where she's balancing her finances. She's in an energy where she feels like what she went through made her stronger. And she's also in an energy where she's not using conventional methods of letting people know how she's moved. She's moving in silence. And in her mind, she's saying, da na 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 inspect the gadget. Hoo Yes. I ain't putting none of that out there no more. I'm being silence. I'm moving in silence. I ain't letting nobody know what I'm doing. I'm just going to do it. And they just going to watch and see me shine, says Divine Feminine in this Ten of Pentacles energy. I know that's right. Get them in her actual gifts. Get them spiritual blessings. Get that grounding. I know that's right, Divine Feminine. But we want to know why your haters is in the energy. Why they saying, yeah. Mm. They over there hating because you doing it. You on you. I know that's right. Divine Feminine saying, how you going to get mad at me? Because I pulled a you on you. You know what I'm saying? When you was ghosting me, I pulled that on me. Mm. When you was blocking me, I pulled that out on me. Yes, I pulled that all the way out my ass. Yes, I pulled the you on you. And now you can't take it. You in that energy, yeah, you can't take that I pulled it, a you on you. Says Divine Feminine. Mm-mm. So Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today. How is Divine Feminine in the energy where she's saying, don't get mad at me because I pulled a you on you. You know what I'm saying? Don't get mad at me. And the first card that come out is you in denial, says Divine Feminine. You thought Divine Feminine loved you that much that she was going to take you back. You thought Divine Feminine loved you that much that she was going to let you put her in a third party energy. You thought Divine Feminine, you had a sucker on your hands and she was going to take you back. And now you in a denial energy because you know Divine Feminine out there uh, dating and things. You know Divine Feminine, oh, the first card that comes out is denial. Yes, we have a masculine out here in denial because he know Divine Feminine is out here dating, honey. And he know Divine Feminine is out here meeting those that's better than him, honey. But he's in denial that he cannot stand up to Divine Feminine's new boo. Is that you, boo? Boo, boo. Yes, she's dating. Hey, they in the energy where they still watching. This next card that comes out is inconspicuous slick, bitch. So if you want to know, if you over there dating, yes, the slick bitch know you over there dating too. The slick bitch know you out there shining too. Because this next card that comes out is inconspicuous slick bitch. Yes. And the next, the next card that come out is toxic. Yeah. The inconspicuous toxic bitch is out there being toxic, honey. She's out there putting salts on your name. She's so shaking. She's shaking, hating on your girl. Yes, and the next card that come out is liar, liar, pants on fire. So if you wanted to know, baby, if they still thinking about you, honey, if they're still in, in your energy, darling dear, yes, they are. They're in your energy lying about the star. Yes. Mm-hmm. And they're out there fake flexing, my dear. This next card that come out is fake flexing, yes. They're out there flex flexing, my dear, because every time that you go shopping, mm -hmm, they say, Divine Feminine will put on this. I'll go spend my money and try to match her five. They're out there fake flexing, trying to be you, being a copycat. Yes. And doing this 
and such that they're not taking care of their kids because the next card that come out is child neglect, black parenting, scared of, hates burn, etc., etc. Yes, they're too busy trying to find where you did with the blueprint, darling. You know, they're going to the store. They're trying to be you. They're fixing their hair, trying to be you. Oh, she had on pink makeup today. I think I'm going to put on pink makeup too. Yeah, that one. They're so busy in their energy where they're putting so much of their energy into what they, what you're doing. They're not taking care of their kids. This next card that come out is child neglect. Yes, honey. And whatever uh, abuse that they're doing to their kids... They are now facing incarceration. This next card that comes out, locked up. I'm locked up. It won't let me out. They won't let me out. And I'm not making no jokes about um people doing um things to children because I used to work at Child and Family Services, and that is a a salty sight. There are very much people out here that want to have children and we have people out here doing mean and hateful things and neglectful things to their children. And those that out here that want to have them can't. But the ones that have them do not respect their blessings. Yes. Because they're so curious about you. Instead of putting energies into their kids and taking care of their kids, they're curious about you. The next card that come out is curious about you. This is what they put their energy into you because they haunted what they did to you. And this will be the comic. She's haunted with all of the spells and the magic and the hating because your ancestors got back to her and they are haunting her. They are doing a lot of mind fuckery and she can't take it. Yes. And she can't take this either that the masculine is crying for you. He doing that tea jerking, crying for you. Yes, the next card that comes out is crying over you. Sad, hurt, and upset. Yes, he's still tear jerking, my dear. Yes, he's still doing that thing with his hand and crying. Yes, mm-hmm. And it's not a happy home over there, baby. There's constant third parties on both ends, the karmic and divine masculine. Yes, there's constant competition. This is why the masculine is still looking to see if you have a man. This next card that come out, I don't trust nothing about them, says divine feminine. I know you still lurking. I know you still stalking. And this next card that comes out is don't trust nothing about them, Divine Feminine. They still up to their same trickery. Mm-hmm. What else is they still up to, Divine? They still up to uh, still having sex with many. This will be the, uh, the comic. And she knows she's nothing but sex. Okay, however, she's still dirt digging on you. This next card that comes out is looking for dirt, vice versa. Yes. So if you wanted to know if the comic was still up in your business, e, yes, she is, darling dear. She's trying to get some intel on you, my friend. Yes. And what? Divine Feminine is still unbothered. The next card that comes out is unbothered. <laughs> Holy Spirit, Holy Angel. Oh, Lord. And the next two cards that want to come out is Divine Feminist saying, Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Okay? You are a simple bitch that's crying out for help. Okay? Say it with me now. Fuck you. You are a simple bitch crying out for help. So the F you call comes out and the crying out for help card. So Divine Feminine said, you simple bitch, fuck you. I am unfazed. Look, I am unbothered. Fuck you. I am unbothered. Okay? Fuck you. You simple bitch that's crying out for help, okay? What else is you saying, Divine Feminine? I am unfazed. 
Because I know that your ass is over there receiving bad karma, says Divine Feminine. This is why you mad at me because I pulled a you on you. Because I am unfazed, baby. Because I know my ancestors is over there mind fucking you and Divine Masculine for what both of y'all did to me, says Divine Feminine. Mm. And Divine Feminine says, yes, girl, I know that you keep on getting it. Girl, where did these calls come from? These calls do not belong in here. Everybody know. Oh, my God. Divine Feminine is trying to tell you something, girl. Look, abortion came out and the three Jesus calls come out. So we about to read this because we know we read these calls at the end. So, Divine, what are you trying to tell us about abortions, which you do not like? Heavenly Father, we know this. I am Catholic, and I know you don't do the abortion thing. But since Heavenly Father got into these cards, we're going to figure out what you want to say. Unto you is given into God a mystery of the kingdom. Judge not. And you will not be judged. So our father is saying he forgive you for these abortions, girl. Your faith have saved you. Go in peace. Listen, girl, are you listening to our father? He is trying to tell you to stop it with this magic and stop it with these abortions and stop it with these behaviors. But he's also saying, I forgive you, my child, because this is what our father do. And he wants you to know this comment. And this is deep, and my heart is beating so fast. And my hand is shaking. If you do not see it, my hand is shaking. Our Father is telling you something, Carmen. Seriously, I feel that all in my body. Our Father is trying to tell you something, Carmen. Seriously, stop it with the abortions now. But he's saying he forgive you. Carmen, you're doing too much now. You're doing too much. You're doing a little bit too much. And I'm getting a strong feeling that this comic really is doing too much. She's doing too much. Seriously. These three cards did not come out for nothing. And I'm every single time that I get one of these comic reads and they be strong like this, I'm getting a real bad, like, pain in my back. These cards do not belong in this deck. I feel it, Divine. I hear what you're saying. But is the comic going to listen to what you're trying to tell her? Is he going to listen? Is she going to listen, Father? This is what I want to know. Is she going to listen, Father? This is what I want to know. Holy Father, Holy Angels, is she going to listen to your warning? Is she going to heed your warning? Is she going to stop her ways, Father? <sighs> Y'all calls did not belong there for no reason. And I separated every single day it's called. And I shuffled before I started. And those three calls came out. And I felt that. My heart was beating so fast. And I felt a, 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 like a surge in my back. Anyway. Is she going to heed your warning to stop it with the magic? Stop it with the sex? Stop it with her evil ways? Holy Father. Is she going to stop it? This is what we want to know. Divine Heavenly Father. Is she going to stop it? Divine Heavenly Father, is she going to stop it? I mean, like, the top of my shoulder blade is like somebody is pushing like this. In, the, in my back right here. Is she going to stop it, Father? Is she going to stop it? That is going to be a no. That is going to be a no. This comic is not going to stop it. This comic is not going to listen to our father. She's not. She's going to continue with her ways. This next card that comes out is Sex Kitten. And it came in reverse. Which means that this person is not going to listen to our divine. They're going to continue with the abortions. They're going to continue with the spell magic. 
<laughs> and all these things are bad karma that they are telling them to stop. Ow! They're not going to stop. They're not going to stop. Whoever this comic is in this energy, this one is dark. Divine, is there anything that you want to tell them since they're not listening? Is there anything that you want them to know? This is insane. Your divine father says things you know wrong. You know, right for wrong, he gave you a choice. Our divine gave you a choice, and you got right for wrong. And if you feel like you did wrong, you ask for forgiveness. But if you don't ask for forgiveness and continue to do your evil and hateful ways, you be punished with those actions. Divine Heavenly Father, I'm feeling all these energies, and they are not good. They are not good. They are not good. They are not good. So our father and ancestors of this feminine that they did to this, how do you feel about this holy father? Our heavenly father is saying, divine is saying game over. They tired of playing these games with this person. They tied. They gave them too many chances. Your ancestors, I gave them too many chances. And now divine is just saying it's time. It's just game over. However, on divine feminist energy, our divine is saying you are born to shine. You dusted that off. You dusted that off. You dusted off that hate. You dusted off all those things that they did to you and you sent it back you diamond you were born to shine and i can't see i'm sorry i gotta put my glasses on even though my eyes is red okay yes you were born to shine says our divine our divine said you dusted yourself off you dusted yourself off you were born to shine. You dusted yourself off. You pick yourself up by the boot steps, by your bootstraps, and you got yourself together. What else is our divine saying to this person? That person that was all up in your energy, they have mental health concerns. You are the focus of their life. They constantly keep your name and gossip in their mouth. Our divine heavenly father is saying, continue to stay six feet away from them. They have legal issues. They have legal issues. They have dysfunctional family issues. They are holding grudges and they are still tripping on you yes yes they are still tripping on you they are still trying to do mind fuckery because they are a a spiritual hater however however they do mind fuckery this spiritual hater However, you're going to dodge that shit. The next call come out is dodging a bullet. So what we saying? We got the Jolly Tree Maker, Designer Calls Faker, the third party blues, the third party blues. We got the Jolly Tree Maker, Designer Calls Faker, third party seeker, entertainment web people, matches back, comic blues, yes honey, you dodged them bullets with the matches back, comic blues, you dodged them bullets baby girl, our divine, fam our divine saying you keep on shopping and looking purity and use your retail therapy cause they got that blood on their hands baby, not you. 
They have to deal with the divine, not you. You continue to be you, and they're going to continue to have alcohol abuse to what they did. They're going to continue to seek assistance to do magic. They're not going to stop. They're going to also seek assistance from their friends to do magic. Yes. So what is this person going to continue to do that our divine told them to stop? They're going to continue to drink and be in an energy of alcohol abuse. They're going to be in the energy where they're still going to do magic and they're going to have their friends to help them. They're going to still be in the energy where they're still looking you up, hawking and stalking, and the friends doing tag team hate. Okay, and then she's going to play victim. All right, that's what she's going to do. So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we would like to know the spirit of those why they are mad because Divine Feminine said, y'all going to get mad at me because I pulled a you on you. This is why they stay in the energy. Yes, why are they still mad at her? She done pulled back her energy. Okay, because they don't have no ancestral guys. Because they feel because of what they did to you, they have a curse on them. They, you sound stupid, Carmen. You sound stupid as hell. You gonna bring your ancestral fuck up on Divine Feminine. Girl, I'm gonna need you to focus. Did, girl, uh, I can't even talk. Did she say her karma and her ancestors not fucking with her is because of you? Okay, I'm, that one right there just took me for a loop. But anyway, this is the call for no ancestral guidance. Because her ancestors said that she has a big ego. And her ancestor said that she is confused. And her ancestor said that she is a fraud. And her ancestor said that she is a damn mattress back. And her ancestor said that she is a wolf in sheep's clothing. That's why she don't have no ancestors. And I'm no ancestral guidance. And I'm going to leave on that one. That's why they getting mad at you. Because you pulled a you on you. Yes. Your ancestors love you. That's why they mad at you. Your ancestors protect you. That's why they love you. But you gonna get mad at me. <laughs> Excuse me. You cannot get mad at me. Girl, I ain't finished with you. Mm-mm. You can't put that on. Mm-mm. I'm not gonna let you. I'm not gonna leave today. I'm not gonna leave today with you putting that one on Divine Feminine. And the next card that come out is back. You cannot put your back. And I'm glad I didn't finish, Divine. Thank you for letting me continue to get out your message. 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 Yes. Message. Our Divine says, girl, don't you do it. Don't you put that bad karma on Divine Feminine. She too, she ain't worrying about your old stank car. She's too busy over there with it. So the next two cards that come out is bad karma. Our divine saying, girl, don't you put that bad karma on that girl. She too busy over there waiting to be trying to do something to you, girl. You drunk bitch. No, you didn't, says divine feminine. That's why you sitting over there all confused and lying on me. Your ass stay too damn drunk to remember something. Continue to stay off the deck. Continue to stay on the pole, says Divine Feminine. Because your ass is off the hook and you are thirsty. Yes, what else is you saying, Divine Feminine? Say she going to lie on you like that. Girl, no, she did. Oh, Lord, Divine Feminine said, yes, I know she's a carpet guy. I know you a carpet guy. And this come in reverse. Copycat, but I wanted you to see the copycat because them little cats is pretty and I don't like cats. But I like these cats because these cats look like the thunder, 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 thunder cats. Yes, it looked like um Panthro. Yes, I love that. That one. 
Yes, I love that one. Yes, but anyway, yes, Divine Feminist says she know you is a copycat bitch. Because she got photo evidence. She know you a copycat bitch. She know you be looking at her pictures. And she said, I oh, bitch, I know you ain't shit. You ain't shit. She said, you a groupie bitch. You ain't shit, you groupie bitch. You drunk group, group, group. You drunk group, group. You drunk groupie bitch. And you tried to fuck with my tongue, but you got me. You drunk, you drunk groupie bitch. How about that? How about that? We'll call one to fall out. Yeah, divine feminist said, I know you got bad habits, girl. Yeah, I know you got narcissistic behaviors, girl. I know you can't keep your hands to yourself, girl. And I know you stay your monkey ass in a doctor, girl. I know you stay your monkey ass in a doctor. You need to understand. You need to make love to your hand. You know being burnt ain't funny. You better play with yourself like it owe you money. Yes, girl. Instead of getting these shot, 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 shots. In your ass. And she said, girl, I know you are a, a happiness hater. The next card that come out is happiness hater. And she said, I know that you got drug addictions, girl. Because you hating on my success. And she saying, girl, yeah, I even know, girl, that you even like me like that. The next card that come out is lick love. Yeah. And the Bible for everyone is saying, yeah, girl, I knew. I know that you be having those terror readings done on me. They be telling you that divine feminine over there. Shining, 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 yeah. All of this winning and you lose your mind. Yes! You over there losing your mind, girl. You over there doing drugs, girl. Mm-hmm. Say it to yourself, I want to be your man. I want to be your man. No, girl. Divine Feminist say, you do not want to be my man, girl, because I do not rub foggy books. I don't do that. I don't do that. Nah, I don't do that. Mm, nah, I don't do that. Mm. Mm. And Divine Feminist say, yeah, girl, I know you a spiritual hater. That's why you be mad all the time, girl, with your old bipolar ass. So the next card that come out is spiritual hater. And the next card that come out of that is angry all the goddamn time. Because you got that ball. And the Divine Feminist say, I know, girl, that you and your friends, y'all be tag teaming that hate on me. And all y'all be mad because y'all over there see me winning. Mm-hmm. She said, y'all got mad. Mm-hmm. Divine Masculine. This is why you mad at me. Because I pulled a you on you. I moved on, darling, there. I moved on to the... I moved on from the playa. From the Himalaya. That was wasting my goddamn time. Yes. So Divine Feminist says she moved on. From this playa. That was wasting her in effing time. And she knew that you was always in an energy where you was talking to other females and you was saying, let's get a room. And she saying, yeah, mm-hmm. why you going to get mad at me? Because I pulled a you on you. Now I'm making big girl moves. Mm-hmm. The next girl that comes out is making me moves. That's why you mad at me. And she saying, yeah, copycat bitch. You mad at me because I pulled back my pink print. Mm-hmm. You wanted to round confused. She said, it's okay. It's okay. We know you can't see clearly because I done pulled back my energy. I done pulled back my style. I done did some rethinking and patterning, repatterning my pink print. Yes. And she saying, divine masculine, well, I know you still hook. You delusional, baby, because you know I'm giving this thing thing up to somebody else, boo. And you reflecting on that you didn't treat me right because I got a new boo. Boo, boo, I'm out here doing all those things that you was doing. Mm-hmm. 
I'm out here dating with my friends. Mm -hmm. I'm out here doing me. Mm -hmm. That's why you mad. Because I pulled a you on you. You mad because this one got more money than you. Mm -hmm. I forgot to say, this one right here, this successful one, this one, he is the one that Divine Feminine is dating. And he is mad. And him gossip to him friends and all these things about your new boo-boos that you be dating and things. Mm-hmm. And Divine Masculine, I'm going to leave it on that one. He's receiving karma for dealing with the karmic. So this last card that come out is karma for the karmic. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the next card that comes out is third parties. Mm -hmm. That's why you're receiving your karma from the karmic. Because she's putting the divine masculine is now being put in a third party energy with another man. Those are two men there with a woman in the, bit in the middle. Divine masculine, baby. It says karma from the karmic. Let me move my hand. Karma from the karmic. And the karma that he is receiving now, the karmic, mm -hmm, is putting divine masculine. And third party energy. Mm-hmm. So that's why him mad at you. Because now he getting what was done to you. It's being done to him. And I dropped the mic with that. Yes. But we are going to leave with these cards again. Says Heavenly Father. Yes. Come on. Let's come in again. Since you had something to say to the comic and she didn't want to listen, what do you have to say to the collective? How do you want them to move today? <laughs> Heavenly Father. Yes, our Heavenly Father saying, I heal the sick. I therein say unto you, the kingdom come. The kingdom of God is come nigh unto you. So divine family, our father wants you to know because you listen. Oh, I forgot to say who this was, Luke 10, 9. Our father said because you listen to him, baby girl. These are the gifts that he's going to give you. What else do you have to say to baby girl? And I took one from the bottom of the deck. Peace be unto you as my father has sent me, says John 20, 21. So this is how our father wants you to move. Why? Because you listen to him. And I'm going to drop the mic on. If you like my vibe, like, share, and subscribe. Mm -hmm. Be great on purpose because you are.